Hi, by the way. Oh, look. Cabin episode, guys. One of those things. What the shock. Yeah, I walked past the door. So I thought, let's work on the outside a bit. There is at least one more thing that is kind of unfinished right now. Or rather, I would say, in desperate need for an upgrade. Uh, the summer... Summer is almost over. And I thought um, the upgrade should be done right now. Rather than in the middle of the winter. So this situation here. I did this last winter. Freezing my ass off trying to install this uh, elevator to heaven. But the idea itself is pretty cool. There is a stump down there and that tree stump, including this rock, are the foundation pieces for this entire staircase. Pretty cool design, I really like it. But it needs an upgrade. So I left this part unfinished. My formal plan was that I will add um, some type of... Um, well, one of those things. Dude, my freaking ass! Get stuck here! And my idea was to add a slide down there, so you could uh, do your sliding business, come back to the castle, and repeat a bunch of times until you're hungry or something, I don't know, or sleepy, whatever kids do these days. But I never really uh, finished off adding that lighting because um, we had a bit of change of plans, which we will do in this video. So the plans, guys. So I'm gonna build some type of a deck here for the second access door. Try to connect that deck up with that joint somehow. The deck should extend somewhere, I don't know, here. And then the sliding will go from this way instead. We're not sure yet if we're gonna add a straight slide or get some type of a tunnel or angle slide. All in all, not really that much to do. You just need to do a thick thing there and a slight thing there. And that's pretty much it. Now, I'd rather not really demolish this very much. It took me a while to build this. I think I was freezing my balls off for about two days straight. So I don't really want to um, really demolish it that much. So I'm thinking maybe like cut it off from here somewhere, make it straight like. That way the entrance will be uh, better. Right now the entrance is kind of... Going in there at an angle, it, it sucks. So I'm gonna make it straight and most likely gonna connect the new balcony up with that joint. So let's just, let's, let's do this. I'm super amazed these wheels are still running. No air in the tires, no bearings in there. How is this thing still holding on? It's been years, like so. Indestructible tires. If they keep holding on like so, I'm just gonna nail them to the cabin wall or something. Point east. You're not supposed to point east. You're not Russian, bro. Stop pointing east. That's better.
Yeah. Spare parts. You can stop holding now. I'm just kind of making this up as I go along. Cut from here, cut from there, and then it will be cool. Guys, is it straight? Just uh, let me know. Send me a postcard or something. Another spy screw somewhere. Spy screws, man. Piss off, spies. So I'm gonna make a little step here. I'm thinking cut it off from somewhere here. seems pretty strong. I weigh considerably more than your average um, kid. It's five year old, so <laughs> I guess it's fine. Maybe I don't need an extra boost down here. This will do. For you now, it's a lot better to get inside. A lot better than before. So, I'm gonna put a little step here. It's gonna be very small, like maybe two centimeters. I'm not sure if it's worth it. Maybe not. But it's a bit easier for me to build. Man, I love those things. They're super easy to use. Fastest and cheapest anchors. Plus they will kind of last forever. Guess we hit a rock or something. Yeah, I'm thinking it's the roots. It's very close to the stump. I'm gonna try this spot, maybe I will have some better luck with that.
starting to look like a balcony now. Score. Need one more support in the center, then we should be solid. I may need to add some support. On the thing. Definitely in the center, I need to do something with that. Wish my hands were longer, man. This is ridiculous. You can never reach stuff. I mean, what gives? I've been thinking uh, how to reinforce this bit. I mean, it's a bit. It seems strong enough, but uh, it's only sitting on two screws. Screws are the type of material that can just instantly break out of the blue. So let's just add a bunch of more of them. Guys, I'm pretty sure Darson can even play pool up here. Should be strong enough. Here's a healthy tip for you. If you have a problem, a problem you can't really solve, just remember this tip. All you need to do is add a bunch of more screws, tape, or paint. Works every time, by the way. But anyway, guys, let's just let's just kind of go pants mode with uh, this uh, deck mode. Stick pants mode.
mean Please fit, please fit, please fit. Yay! I think I'm pretty much finished with the balcony bit. Now, before you jump my bones about those decking boards being upside down, then uh, check this out. Uh, got grooves here. And it, and it also has uh, piss off, son. And it also has um, grooves down here as well. So I can't install it the wrong way if it has grooves on both sides. Jokes on you, buddy. But anyway, overall, pretty cute little balcony thing, bro. This cabin, it has balconies on both sides now. Mm -hmm. it take, takes me like five minutes to walk around the building. What the hell? Anyway, it has the beefcake balcony up there, in addition to the durance area. And the little cake balcony right there, in addition to the... This is completely normal. This is like a 16-star Soviet hotel. This is very normal. So next uh, portion would be the sliding. I'm not really 100% sure which slide we'll choose as of right now. So in the end, we might do some modifications to this area. Currently, I went with the idea that the slide will be straight down from the Keats uh, space port. But in the meantime, I also need to modify those doors now slightly. So after I made the entrance about 6000% better, I immediately noticed the problem. So I have like a... Bug. I have a bug. Addition to the bug though, I have a gut entrance hole now. You don't really want any guts in there. Piss and crap all over the place. Don't need those little devils. I already have a bunch of them running around everywhere. So I need to make the door longer, but um, I'm thinking also I'm gonna remove this bit. Eliminate or reduce the chance of tripping on this point. I don't think it's structural or anything like that, so I can... So this thing can just get lost. Holy crap! What a bug! Check this out, guys. What a buggy! Brave little fellow. What's up, bro? How are you doing? Relax. Okay, well, you go do your thing, I guess. I'm not cleaning that up. I build stuff, I don't clean stuff. Get it, get it through your thick head. It's even worse now. Maybe I can modify this a bit. I'm not sure if I have any more of these boards left though. 
that's a question right now. I don't really want to make a new one. Making a new one will take me like two minutes, five minutes. That is way too long. So let's try to modify this one. Eureka! One, two, two, three. So I can build an entire house out of this. I'm, I'm so incredibly lucky with this project. Lucky bats. Man, that's a really stupid cap. What is that, like two centimeters maybe? Well, no cats can get in there, that's for sure, but... Um, um. Now I've noticed one thing, that the gates really struggle with these types of locks to open and close. So maybe the magnets have always been my friend. Maybe this is a better option. Then they don't really need to worry about locking it if uh, if it will kind of self-lock. Somewhere here, maybe. Almost. Mm. This is solid. Yeah guys, so when you're getting these types of magnets, make sure you're getting uh, the ones that have double magnets in them. And these types, which only have one, these are just... These are bussy magnets, man. This worthless junk, don't buy these. Rather get these. Yeah, that will definitely work. Now for this thing. We don't ha I don't have a slide right now. I'm gonna put this project on hold for a moment. Until I can figure out the slide situation. Not sure if we're gonna go with a um, curved slide, with a tunnel, or just some pointless straight crap. Don't give me that look. Stand straight. Upright. Do something useful for a living. You've been freaking useless for the last half a year at least. Fine, bro. Stare at your motherland. Soviet Union that way. Uh, I mean, Russia. Okay, I'm going to go to the 
Finished. Freaking. Uh, it's quite steep. It's like rocket. <laughs> yeah, man, this is too steep, I think. What about on that side? Man, this is a lot better. This is a lot better. These kiddos won't break their legs or necks or stuff. Yeah, let's add it on this uh, side instead. It's also not wide enough to cover this entire cap. I would still have some holes next to it. Decided to go with the cheapest option. So this was about $100. I did also find uh, that uh, curly sliding, but for some weird reason. That one was $1,800. It would make a lot more sense to get 18 of these instead of that curly piece of crap. I could find like a really long hill, glue or bolt 18 of them together. Now that would be a ride. Once in a lifetime type of ride. Maybe one day. Yeah, I'm not going to get out of here. Good job, bro. You worked well. I guess uh, that's also do fat for this ride. Seems pretty finished. Oh, but there's more. I have one more idea.
I got this idea while sitting in the crapper, so it has to be good. Väike puul sul võetud, mine võtta suurem puul. Come on! Rap, kuidas peab seal peab ujatama peab? That will do just fine. Do you really think? Where well, you got some planty plants here? Why are you sleeping? Climb. Do your thing. Go up the mountain or something. Drunk soy and plants, man. Freaking drunk plant. Anyway, I think it's worth it. You know, uh, once it's fully grown, then it's gonna be like a tunnel effect there. Just go in the tunnel. Imagine this green wall here. This is amazing. Continue through the tunnel thing. Reach the grand staircase. Up the stairs we go. Party platform, express ride downstairs, billion dollar view into unmaintained bunch of crap. But this is nothing guys. That view is even better. Soviet five star hotel that. Bunch of deadly asbestos. Yummy, yummy. Anyway, let's go into the hotel. Hotel link. We have reached the corner, not much else to it. Some day building, plastic table, Disney castle, food, mm, no idea. Another corner there. Man, I've been searching for this for over a year now. Is it really forgot it here? Wow, I thought somebody stole it or something. But anyway, um, clock corner, crew, water bottle, nothing and um, fire escape to the party bed so guys gonna wrap this video up now think that's about it yeah i think it turned out great great little upgrade definitely better what um, i had before well to be honest i did not have anything before which so, not sure if I can call it an upgrade even. It's like an addition. I'm really glad I got to keep that. I did not want to remove that. Spent like two days building that thing. So that that would have been a complete waste of time then. If I just bulldozed that down. So I could really nicely um, mend these two together. I think that setup is pretty good there. Now this bit... Uh, it's fine sitting here as is. It's not gonna kill anyone. Unless they were jumping on the roof here, then it would be a problem. Asbestos roof material? 
it's fine as long as it's dormant. You sh should not really touch it very much. Now I will remove this eventually, obviously, but not right now. I actually want to completely finish the cabin off first. And then maybe I will focus on this uh, bomb shelter thing. Maybe. But anyway, catch you later, alligator. Yeah. Let's be honest, who didn't see that coming? Whenever somebody is making a mess, that somebody also has to clean up that mess. That should be written somewhere. <laughs>